if the patient was able to stand and transfer to a bedside chair, but is not able to stand and transfer out of the chair back to bed, the caregiver will need to use PPE. If a lift and sling are not available or not appropriate, the caregiver may perform a sit-to-sit -sit transfer using a slide sheet and wheelchair with removable arm. The patient is instructed to lean from side to side while the caregiver places a folded slide sheet under the patient's bottom and thighs. The caregiver will assist the patient to scoot forward in the chair and turn her legs to the side, away from the wheelchair. The wheelchair is placed near the front edge of the bedside chair and the arm is removed. Folded bed linen or a pillow may be used to bridge the gap between bedside chair and wheelchair. The caregiver stands in front of the patient, supports the wheelchair with one hand, and places the other hand near the patient's far hip or pelvis. The patient is instructed to scoot and slide her bottom on the folded slide sheet and slide from the bedside chair into the wheelchair. Once in place, the slide sheet is removed, the armrest is returned to the wheelchair, and the patient is wheeled back to the bedside. To transfer from wheelchair back to bed, ensure the mattress is slightly lower than the wheelchair seat. Pad the space between the wheelchair and bed with folded bed linen. Take a single slide sheet, fold it in half, and tuck the slide sheet under the patient's bottom and thigh. Assist the patient to scoot forward in the wheelchair so her bottom slides in front of the wheel, not over it. Ensure the patient is able to place her hand on the mattress surface, not on the slide sheet. The caregiver stands in front of the patient and supports the wheelchair with one hand while guiding the patient near the hip and pelvis with the other. Once the patient is in the bed, the caregiver may assist the patient to scoot back onto the bed by lightly guiding the patient's hip and lower extremity on one side and then the other.